Australian model and actress Holly Valance has been accused of triggering lefties. The former Neighbours star, who's married to British billionaire property developer Nick Candy, has opened up about her politics, insisting that as people get older and wiser, they tend to wake up and go to the right. I would say that everyone starts off as a lefty and then wakes up at some point after you start either making money, working, trying to run a business, trying to buy a home and then realise what crap ideas they all are and then you go to the right. Holly Valance made the comments while attending conservative political event Popcon launched by former Prime Minister Liz Truss in London. The 40-year-old actress also shared her views about climate change policies, insisting there's no climate crisis. I just think the climate crisis or lack of is, is not a crisis. I mean, the air is better than when I was growing up. We used to stink walking down the street when I was growing up. Cleaner, cheaper energy is what we need. It's, we're perfectly able to get it and have it, but we're just putting all these restrictions on normal people. We're just trying to go about their business, get to work, pick up their children from school, go to the supermarket. It's just insanity. It's like smashing your head up against a wall every day. The internet is reacting to the comments. Many on X agree with Holly Valance and have posted messages of encouragement such as well said, but others have slammed the star, insisting that her politics changed once she quote, got rich and accused her of being selfish. Others have issued a warning that her message is triggering for lefties. Joining me are Daniel Weil, Deputy Executive Director of the Institute of Public Affairs and Evelyn Ray, Sky News presenter, a regular commentator, on this show. Daniel, how true is this? Well, exactly, Andrew. I think that the point there is that as people work, as they take on responsibility, as they start to raise a family, own a home, uh, they begin to understand the realities of life. They're more immersed in the real economy. Uh, they understand and observe the negative impacts that a lot of government decisions that can have. I mean, just look at the red tape, the green tape, the cost of living, energy prices, and so many of the challenges associated with that. It's inevitable that as people become immersed in, in the real world, they become more conservative, not necessarily ideologically conservative, but temperamentally uh, conservative, where they build up their assets, they build up lots of things in their life, and they naturally want to protect that against the enroachments of those uh, from government and on the left. And I think it's such an interesting example of, of that, Andrew, and uh, you know something that we're seeing much more across our society. Yes, I must confess that I twice worked for the Labor Party. And as for Steve Price, one of our uh, presenters, the less said, the better. Shame on you, Steve. We know where you've been, where I do anyway. Uh, Evelyn, is it true of you as well? She absolutely nails it. It's 100% true. The lefty position is usually one which is very sheltered, moronic and naive. You know, it's students who have never interacted with the real world. It's university lecturers who have never ventured outside of their institutions. And it's politicians who have never held a real job. It's a conclusion that unintelligent people come to with partial bits of information, but when they meet the real world, the world of personal responsibility, they very soon realise that the best person to govern their own lives is not some faceless bureaucracy or mindless politician, it's themselves. And good on her for saying it, good on her for saying it out loud. I hope that people listen and take heed, especially young people who might be listening and watching, learn earlier than most of us do. Well, uh, th for me, always, I think, you know, every, every kid can dream of the perfect picnic. It's when you have to, as the adult, actually organise one, you realise how easy it is <laughs> to forget, say, you know, the bottle opener or, or uh, you know, the, to fill the gas bottle. So that's the difference. It makes you more conservative and less likely to trust the dream. Um,